Mr. Speaker, I met the day met Mr. Antamli there for May 2022 at in his house. Nde was a peace setter, a record setter, and an achiever. Nde was intelligent, forthright, honest, charismatic, and affable. Nde was combative, proactive, and resilient. He was a peacemaker and a nationalist who fought against indiscipline, corruption, cheating of all forms of abuses, sometimes to a fault. And Mr. Speaker, Ghana has lost a statesman, a statesman among few public servants who was not in public life or in public service for purposes of enriching himself. Mr. Speaker, and they didn't just walk integrity, he acted with integrity. Mr. Speaker, he was fortnightly courageous and his integrity in public life not paralleled. In 2005, we all met in Parliament for the first time. I was a one-term member of Parliament, and they joined us in 2005. In fact, when the Honourable Member came to Parliament, Although I was a senior, I learned something from him, which has kept me to date. He's a man of principle, and he was not afraid of anybody. He will tell you as it is. Personified everything contradictory in politics. For those who did not know senior Nabia Ndebugri. Ndebugri was a man who was not afraid to speak on any issue he passionately believed on. It didn't matter whose house was God as far as Ndebugri was concerned. Mr. Speaker, I met Ndebugri in uh, the parliament in 2005. And Mr. Speaker, one thing that actually struck me about him was his very strong will and the stuck to his views. He also espoused his views with strong conviction. Mr. Speaker, very straightforward person and very blunt. Mr. Speaker, he said and he made his views very straight. He didn't care whether it offended anyone on the floor of this house. But then, at the same time, if it's yes, it's yes, you will let you know it. Because of his achievement, we should give him at least a minute silence. May the soul of our late colleague Rest in perfect peace. Amen.